Hey everybody, it's Luke over at Galaxy Tech Review, and today we've got the division on the Acer Aspire VX15 gaming laptop with that GTX 1050 Ti. Thank you for all the people who donated. I'm not going to shout out individual names. Uh, a few people wanted to be anonymous. Uh, they donated to my Stream Labs link. You can find that up in the upper right hand corner of my main YouTube page. Uh, and they helped me with a few dollars here and there, and there were a bunch of you, and I appreciate that. And they wanted the division as the game for me to buy and put up here for you. So that's what we did. Again, donations are always appreciated. Thank you very much, guys. I appreciate it. Now, in the upper left-hand corner, we're going to have MSI Afterburner. It's going to have all of our settings on it. Let's go into settings real quick. We are at 1080p at 60 hertz. Uh, and then if we go into graphics, we are on the medium preset. There is a low preset that you can also play. Uh, medium, I find... Uh, got me anywhere between 50 and 60 frames a second, 45 in the low dips, uh, but did pretty well. Now, at the end of the video, I'll put it on high as well, and you'll see we'll get between 30 and 40 frames a second. So if you're okay with 30 to 40 frames a second, you can play this in high, uh, or you can go custom and you can turn a few things off if you would like to. But this is the medium preset, and this is what we'll be doing most of the gameplay on in this video. Uh, MSI Afterburner, again, will be in the left-hand corner showing you GPU temperature, G GPU memory usage, frames per second, second, uh, CPU temperature, and again, uh, RAM usage for the system. Uh, as you can see, uh, CPU is holding at about 70 to 73 uh, degrees centigrade, so uh, it does a pretty good job. This is the i5 version of the VX15, and the uh, i5 really is, I think, the way to go on this model. And just because of the temperatures uh, with the i7, you have uh, about 15 degrees more. It's going to be in the 80s constantly uh, in very intense gaming. Uh, so anyway, uh, check out the video. Tell me what you guys like down in the comments, what you didn't like if you want to see something else. And remember, you can always donate at uh, Streamlabs. That link is on my page. Supply crate located. Approaching marked location. Secured. Hostiles neutralized. Morning. Hostile forces approaching.
Confirmed. Pickup marked. GTF notified. Great work, Agent. We'll get that food back to the people who need it. In New York, it's your Uncle Ricky. We need to talk. Because I'm a... Agent, we've gotten word of a hostage situation at a bank. Looks like you'll have to go through the subway tunnel to access the building. We need you to move in and minimize the damage. You smoke? Want some cigarettes? Got a fresh pack here, unopened. I'm begging you, please. So there you have the division on the Acer Aspire VX15 gaming laptop. Uh, as I said, it looks really good in medium settings, uh, getting anywhere from, you know, averaging 50 to 60 frames per second on that medium preset. And you do see a few dips depending on where you are uh, into the upper 40s, but not too bad. Uh, overall, this is a pretty graphically intense game. So medium preset is great for this particular laptop and the gameplay is super smooth. I didn't have any problems whatsoever with gameplay. Uh, again, you can go into settings uh, and we did have this at 1080p. Uh, at the medium preset. Uh, I'll set this to high really quickly so you can kind of see what the difference is in the medium to high preset. And you immediately notice that we kind of top out at 40, you know, high, high 30s or maybe middle 40s in the city here. Uh, so if you're okay with over 30 frames per second uh, into the 40s, then this is totally playable on high as well. So uh, you can make your decision on that. And again, of course, there's custom where you can add in uh, any of uh, the settings that you would like to kind of tweak in between to see where you can get it. This was Luke from Galaxy Tech Review. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, please give me a thumbs up if you liked it. Remember to subscribe if you haven't because that always helps me out. And I'll check you guys out on the next video.